Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do your daily vibes for the 12th, October 12th. It's Friday, October 12th. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid, so whenever it resonates, usually this resonates with me. It could be on the day, it could be three days ago, or it could be next week. So we'll see what happens. But anyway, I was shuffling this deck before I started. I was shuffling it, and this is where I stopped. Okay, so Three of Swords. And these are, this is the vice versa deck, so there's stuff on both sides. Looks to me like somebody is going back to get their shield. Okay. So he's, he's facing the storm, facing the rain. It's wet. It's cold. It looks like it's pouring, too. But he, do, he even looks like he's almost content. I mean, he doesn't look like he's really that sad. He's like got a look on his face. All right, I'm going back. I'm going back to get my shield. I'm going to take those swords right out of my heart. Because on the other side, the swords are in the heart. It's the three of swords. He's going to take the... And you see this, it's, you know, that's when it's just been pierced, right? It looks like he's going to go take those swords out of his heart to me. And see the shadow. The shadow is going to, as he gets closer, it's going to go away. It's like he's facing it. I see it. I'm going to get my, I'm taking the swords, I'm dropping them there, I'm taking my shield, and I'm going to go fix it. So anyway, I think that he's going to fill up those holes. That's all he's going to do is fill up those holes with some like resin or something. I don't know what. Anyway, um, what is that stuff called? Doesn't matter. Anyway, he's going to go fill them up, right? He's, he's taking his shield. He's going to fill up those holes. So excellent. Um, and then I was going to shuffle more, but I guess I'm going to, I'm just going to, I had already shuffled quite a bit. We have the six of cups. Six of Cups, and he's up there waiting. The light is on. All the lights are on. The Six of Somebody has been waiting for quite some time for their past to resurface, right? I mean, hey, yeah. Waiting for some closure even, or, you know, just keeping hope. Uh, it looks like somebody may be giving up hope, right? That's what it looks like to me. I've waited a long time. They're on both sides, so we're just going to go ahead and uh, keep going. We might as well just lay them right out, huh? Feel like we are good. And that's what we're gonna do. Woo! Wow. And, on, and the very last card right here, the Page of Cups. Love. So that's a good outcome, huh? Let me make sure this is focused. I'd like to turn that light off, but and then it'd be too dark. Oh my goodness, it looks like somebody is absolutely going to let their worries, their sorrows, fly away. You know, it's no longer, it's in, the, it's in the air. It's like, just take them, go. They are, they're going to float away. The sorrows, the hurt, it looks like, I've, I've focused on this, I've felt guilty, I've thought about it over and over and over again. It's really plagued me. I, I can't even sleep thinking about everything that happened. I feel like somebody has been totally in their head about why they were stabbed, why they were heartbroken. How could you do this to me? You know, there's been a lot of uh, regrets. There's been a lot of 
wondering going on. There's been a lot of whys, a lot of um, anguish that has been suffered for quite some time. And I feel like somebody has waited and waited and waited and waited for somebody to come back. Now I'm reading these cards intuitively, just so you know. I'm looking at the pictures and that's how we're, and anyhow, waiting for somebody to come back to take that leap to head in their direction, somebody from their past. All the while going through a, a, a period of mental anguish while they were waiting. But it feels like now somebody has decided to accept this loss, accept this pain, and change this story. I'm, this is not how the story will end. I've decided that I'm going to take my pride and I'm going to head in a new direction. I'm going to take a leap of faith. I'm going to go after my dreams. We, I mean, that's the Wheel of Fortune up there. It's like I'm taking my power back. Not only that, that is a change of course for the better. It's like destiny and fate are here. To change your change your chapter at this time the time is now it's divine timing for you to take those take those swords out get your shield and fix it we have the queen of queen of pentacles taurus virgo capricorn turning her back Is this the queen or the king? It's the king. Then we have the, the king of cups. Pisces, Cancer, Cor Scorpio turning their back. And we have the king of swords turning, their, turning his back. So we have three kings, three men. Three men that are withdrawn. All three of these men have got of uh, have like gone cold. Okay? They have. I'm sorry. They're not facing their feelings at all. They're not. They're not. They're not facing their emotional feelings. That's for damn sure. They um There's not a whole lot of communication coming through on this day. If you're thinking, this is for today, right? It's for one day or next week or whatever. If you are expecting to get some communication from a man <laughs> um, about, you know, anything. <laughs> it may not be what you want to hear, just saying. Or you may not get it at all, Okay. Just because it feels like we're dealing with somebody who is really dealing with a man that is going through a lot of thinking right now. Really thinking, 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 planning, um, dealing with his own stuff. You know, we got this man who's trying to come up with some sort of stable, secure plan for his future. I mean, and that's a good thing. So if you are a man watching this, we have a man that is being very wise, really, seriously. Even though he's closed off and withdrawn, I mean, he is taking the time to think about things, you know, definitely. So if you're a man here, I see that you are really thinking about your next steps. You're thinking about a woman if you are a man, you are absolutely thinking about a beautiful woman. This is a, you know, the empress. We have a woman here who is very, very worthy. So if you're a woman, this would be you. You have, you have a, this is a woman who is very worthy. She's very beautiful. She's very um, stable. She's love. 
Okay, she's compassionate, she's a healer, she's creative, she's she's it. This is the woman, this is the woman that can do it all. She is, I mean, she's just perfect. So there's this woman here that is, I think this woman is being thought of or being sought after, and she could be being sought after. If you're a woman, you could be being sought after by three men. You might have three men after you. If you've reached this point of self-worthiness and, and love, and you know, you have to get to the empress point where you don't settle. The empress doesn't settle. She knows her worth. She seriously does not settle. She doesn't play games with cheaters. If you're if you are one of those women or men that are you know involved in third party and I'm not judging, okay? I'm really not. You're not the empress. The empress knows better. Any the empress does not get involved in third party situations. Okay? Just got to throw that out there. It's the truth. Don't get that false persona that you're the empress if you're if you're cheating because you ain't. Anyhow, the empress knows her worth and because and the men knows that this woman doesn't play those cheating games and that's why they want her. So, this we have a woman here that is being sought after by, I'd say, three men. Because she knows what she's worth. Okay, so if that's you, congratulations. The wheel is spinning, and I'd say it's spinning in your favor. Somebody's been holding on to the past for a really long time. And now they're ready to start on a new journey. There's been a lot of despair. There's been a lot of anguish. There's been a lot of depression. But it feels as though somebody has come to the point of collapse almost. It's time for me to fly. It's time for me to fly. So I feel as though... There's in a couple different scenarios here. There's a change of course. And we have a man for sure that is going within to make some conscious changes to drop, to drop his could even be a grudge. To drop whatever it is that he's carrying around with him. I mean, this 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 heaviness is 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 in the middle of the, this these men. So we have a man that is really overwhelmed with his need to make a decision. He needs to make a decision, perhaps because his beautiful woman is no longer going to hang on to the past. I don't know. Maybe we have a man that is, who knows what he's thinking, but he's got an overwhelming situation here. Very overwhelming. And he needs to shit or get off the pot. Because there's other opportunities for this woman. So, I mean, there is. We have a woman here. That it, she has multiple opportunities for love. And we have a man that knows it. Okay? We have, or men that knows it. This does affect, there's one of these men is somebody from your past. Okay? One of these men is someone from your past. This man has been really contemplating. This is the man that's been worrying. 
This man has been trying to think about making the right decision. Is it this? What's the right decision here? What's the right decision here? Can I go back to my past? That she's been waiting, but I think that she, because this is mirroring. Okay, so this is her. This would be her taking those swords out, grabbing her shield, and. Is that, what is that, a shield? Looks like a shield. Could be a gravestone, I suppose. There's still, there's still a flower that's alive, though. There's still some sort, and the shadow is going to... It looked like a shadow before. See, I see all kinds of things. Um... I think this is a savior, a savior. Somebody is coming to take the, the, the swords out. Oh my God, that's what this came to me. This is somebody that's coming to save the day. Oh my goodness gracious. <laughs> okay, so there is some, somebody else is coming in. Somebody else is coming in. So just, I have to tell you, I mean, this, I'm not going to keep this reading going because it's pretty, it's not for everybody. There's a change, of course, with the Wheel of Fortune. There's an absolute, it's like destiny says, okay, time to change things. Time to change things. And I feel like there's a man that's been thinking about his decisions, thinking about what he's going to do, you know, what his future holds. And thinking about the past, thinking about a new beginning and thinking about a past. Okay, so I think there's a man that's been trying to decipher. We have a woman here that's experienced a lot of pain. She's gained a lot of wisdom. She's right where she needs to be. She's very comfortable, you know. She's she's good. She's got multiple opportunities for love, multiple. And we have, she probably has three viable suitors. And um, one of them is from the past. And the past probably knows that she has viable suitors. And he either has to step up to the plate and take a risk or <laughs> collapse, whatever. Um, I feel like there is going to be an offer, okay, with this page of cups. There's a page of cups here. So that we have some love, a message of love that's coming in from somebody. Um... This is really, really good fortune with this Wheel of Fortune. It is. The Wheel of Fortune is good luck. Um, we have a... for This is for a woman who has reached the point of self-love, self-worth, self-confidence, self-esteem. The woman that, you know, has been sitting back waiting. The woman that is... Wise enough to know better. Okay, there's a woman here that is, it looks like, going to receive a message from somebody who's really, really, he could receive three messages, put it that way, from three different people, just saying. But we want to we wanna get some of these right here, I didn't even talk about those. The Page of Swords is, this guy is ready to fight the storm. He's got his armor on. He's ready to go. He's ready to go after what he wants. He's going to go through that storm. And he wants to stick it out. This guy is like ready to fight. He's, he don't care. He don't care what, what's in front of him. He's ready. He's going. This one right here is... Thinking about his future. Thinking about his stability. Where is he going to be the most stable? What is What can he do to keep things stable? What does he need to do to feel secure and to make the other person feel secure? This guy is in thinking mode. Thinking about 
what he has to do next. I mean, he's making plans. What do I have to do to make this work? This guy is thinking about what is most emotional. You know, what is most... What's his heart? He's thinking about... Whether he wants to open his heart or not. Whether he he's, a, you know, emotionally available. I don't think he's ready to face it. I don't think this guy is ready to... I mean, the cup is up there. I don't know what the hell this thing is. This guy is in and out. He doesn't know what to, he doesn't know. He's going back and forth on his decision. This is the confusion. We have one guy that wants to open his heart but just can't we have another guy that is is coming up with a plan really coming up with a plan could be all the same guy and we have this guy who's ready to fight the storm I mean he is he's ready he's ready to fight the storm he's ready to do whatever he it need, he needs to do to get to where he's going. He's not going to give up on this woman. So we have one man. It could be a, a Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. That. May be the one to see your worth. Okay. So if you have a choice. I mean it looks like Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Is, are the, is the one that. Is going to put in the effort, you know, is really, he's not just going to think about it. You know, this guy is just planning. This guy is all over the place. And this guy is going to do it. All right. He's going to do it. He's going to, he's going to take care of business. He's going, he's going to walk through that storm and not give up. So... Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This is Taurus, Libra. Could be any other woman, but that's who it represents. It feels as though we have an opportunity. Well, we have an opportunity for growth with one person. But there's going to be a choice. There's absolutely going to be a choice. This man, all three of these men, whoever they are, could be the one man, but it could be three different men. They've all made conscious changes in their lives. Okay? They have. They've been through some suffering themselves. It's not like they haven't suffered because they have. Over this woman. Yep. Yep. There's a man that has suffered over this woman. Anyway, this is a long, drawn-out reading. I'm sorry. Um, somebody walked away. It's, there's been a delay. There's been a delay. There absolutely has been a delay. Could, could lead to happiness. I mean, here we have the Four of Wands if somebody would communicate. So, I mean, I really feel like there's an opportunity here for, for happiness if somebody would actually communicate. You know, it looks like somebody is thinking about communicating with somebody. 
You know, I think that there's a communication is needed, but they've been blocking the communication. Somebody is, there's a man here that is thinking about communicating with the woman that he wants, but he's not doing it. And in the process, he's losing that woman. And he knows it. That's what this is about. I mean, I can't really get any clearer than that. It's, you know, trying to come up with these words. I it Really, the, the fucking case is. That's what it is. It is. And he's got to, he's going, this is a five of swords. He's going to have to step out of his ego and go get her. Because if he doesn't, somebody else is going to. And that's exactly what this is. This guy, or girl, is walking away. This person's just letting them go. Somebody's waiting. Somebody's somebody is waiting. Keep that in mind. So I don't know who this message is for, but obviously somebody needs to hear it. You want to let your girl go? You want to let your girl go? Is that what you want? Because of your pride? Because of your ego? You want you want this other man to come in and put do put in the fight? Put in the effort to face the storm with your beautiful woman? Because you can't communicate? Now I just put this over here. There's a, there's a message of love coming in. Perhaps from your savior. If you're a woman, so I feel like today is a day, basically, or whenever it is, about making a decision for a man. If you're a woman, just sit back and see what happens. <laughs> if you're a woman, I think, if you're a woman and you are the empress, be prepared to receive some sort of information or clarity or communication or something that makes you happy because it is going to make you happy. Somebody is interested in you. If you are a beautiful woman, doesn't matter. I'm not just talking about outside beauty. I'm not. Be prepared to receive some sort of message of love from a man that wants to put in effort. And you probably have a choice of three. One of them is from your past. One of them is, is coming to save, you know, save you, my savior. I don't know, it seems kind of interesting. Anyway, there's it's been delayed. Your happiness has been delayed. Because of this thinking man. <laughs> this thinking, thinking, thinking man. But. A change is a coming with the wheel of fortune. This is karma, destiny, and fate. Somebody's been watching. So somebody's been watching and somebody's been waiting.
that's what she got for today.